good afternoon. Uh, this video is uh, specially made for one of our customers to uh, show a Seiko. This is a Seiko watch and if you look in the back, I hope you can see this, there's a flywheel that is for the kinetic winding. A lot of the Seiko watches don't have the ability to crown wind it. Uh, that comes with what's called a hacking winding feature, but more uh, they don't all have that. So you take the watch and it doesn't matter if you have it right side up or upside down and you go like this. Let me show you. Or or like like this. You know, in a comfortable position. That's how you wind it. You can turn it around and you see the flywheel going around, winding your watch up, much like you would shake uh, maybe a glass of wine or something. Uh, Seiko tells us that if you have a desk job and you wear your kinetic watch, uh, it's not enough to really fill the spring up. You know, you would have uh, driving a car is, is not enough to fill the spring up. If you have a very active job with your hands, then maybe, but a desk job is not enough and uh, driving a car is not enough. So, a lot of people like watch winders. It's a device that you buy separate and it, it provides the watch with motion um, through electricity. Or, on, on the device, you know, and, and it winds it that way. But you can simply do this in, for a little while. It's not bad, it's good exercise, and it winds it, and then um, and then it keeps it going and through, the, through the day with your regular movement overnight. Um, it's, it, the power reserve is probably not uh, Filled for uh, you have to see if it if it goes overnight. A, a lot of people upgrade the movement to hacking winding. Uh, then you you have and I try to demo that uh, a, a a possibility you simply like your grandfather's watch or like your father's watch wind it like this, but. Um, Some watches don't have that. The crown is not at all connected to any form of spring or winding. It, the winding is done simply like that. The initial winding and then it keeps it going. If you don't do that, you essentially have an unwound watch that, you know, it goes for a little bit but not for long. Um, so this is hopefully helpful to show you when uh, how a kinetic watch is is wound. Let me just make this uh, one more time clear. The watch is there's no battery. It's just a, like you could almost call this a flywheel. It's it's a weight, and sometimes it goes bidirectional and sometimes it is unidirectional where it winds. So when you go like this with your watch upside down or right side up that winds it simple as that then you keep it going you know do this for a few minutes or so and then you put it on your wrist and that through the day will keep it going just fine um, the movements <coughs> are you are known very well for going 10 20 years without service uh, excellent excellent movements from Seiko real workhorses but in order to to get the watch to to keep to keep time for you uh, you gotta wind it uh, like that if uh, you uh, you can send your watch uh, for a movement replacement uh, to us too if you like anybody can uh, and we put a hacking winding movement in then you get the luxury to have not only the genetic, but then you also could wind it through the crown. So thank you very much for watching and I hope that uh, it
is a helpful video. I couldn't find one on YouTube, so I figured I better make one. So, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.